Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to set up your MyLink, Chevy MyLink radio to communicate uh, with Stitcher and Pandora. Um, Pandora is pretty simple. Stitcher has a few more options that kind of make it a little more confusing, but um, just follow me along and I'll get you all set up. First thing you have to do is uh, connect to the MyLink radio via your telephone. Um, I have a Samsung Galaxy S3. So first you're going to have to pair it, Bluetooth pair it. I'm not going to show you how to do that. You should be able to figure that out on your own. Um, so what you want to do is you want to go into your, you have to download the apps first, of course, and create accounts. Um, but the first thing I'm going to show you is Pandora, because Pandora is a little bit easier to set up. So I'll run through that real quick. Um, so just launch Pandora on your phone. Connect to the Wi-Fi. I don't want to connect to Wi-Fi. Okay, so here's my Pandora. Skip the ads. And if I go back to the main screen, you'll see that this is just my list of um, stations that I have already created on here. Um, to create a new station, all you have to do is click in the little search bar, and you can search for different um, stations, whether it's a uh, artist or different genre, or perhaps even a uh, composer. Um, so I'm gonna go back to my list. And there's basically my list. So I have a quite a few of them in there. Um, once you do that, you can actually exit out of Pandora. You don't have to be in it um, to connect to the radio. So what you want to do is uh, switch to your home screen, uh, find your Pandora app, click on that. And what it's going to do is it's going to pull up the very first um, radio station that you have in your list and start playing it. Or perhaps it might, if you already been in there, it might just pick up the one that you were on the last time. Um, to switch between different stations, you can just click the menu button, and there it is. It has a list of all the different stations that you have in there. So you can just use your scroll wheel to select. And and it'll start playing your different radio stations. It can even give us the little um, art there. Up top here, you can see that it has the um, whatever s signal strength your uh, phone has, it'll display it up there. So, you know, if you're uh, losing connection, you can look down and see if um, you only have a couple bars, one or two bars. Um, in here, you can bookmark particular artists or songs, which is nice. And you can also give uh, dislikes and likes, and also skip to the uh, next song if you want to. Um, I think it's like six songs or something before you have to uh, um, just wait for the whole entire song to play through. So that was pretty easy with the Pandora. Now on to the uh, Stitcher app. Um, here's my Stitcher app, so I'm going to click on that. And what you have is a list of different stations. So you can have uh, my stations, things you can browse to shows or smart stations or listen later. Uh, the only one I really deal with is my stations. So if I click on there, the default one that it comes up with is the playlist. And you can just throw a bunch of different things in there um, from different categories and, and kind of build it pretty big. Um, but what Stitcher does is it gives you an opportunity to actually um, create your own categories or your own playlists. So if you hit the little plus here, now I'll ask you to uh, name the playlist. So for this one, I'm just going to call it Comedy. Oops. Comedy, hit save. And now it's asking me to find different stations. So I'll just click on the little plus here, and now it gives the, uh, the different categories that um, Stitcher has. 
Uh, I'll just go into their categories, and it'll list like you know it, it refines the categories here a little bit for you. You can actually click on the little search and actually you know try to find particular shows if you already know what they are. Um, for this, I'm just going to click on their recommended ones and add things from. So we'll click on that one, first one that comes up, and to add it, all you do is hit the little blue plus. I'm going to hit the plus. It'll ask me where I want to add it to. I'll click comedy and hit save. Now I'm going to go back and add a couple more real quick. I'm going to add this one. Hit the plus. Add it to the comedy. Hit save down here. Back up. Scroll through. We'll add this one here. Hit the plus. Comedy. Save. And then I can back on out of there. And go to my stations. And you'll see now that I have a comedy one with those three ones that I've preloaded in there. And you can play at the plus and add one for like news, entertainment, uh, different things. So now that I have that in there, I can just close out my app. Uh, you never have to worry about um, accessing the apps on the phone. You can access them right through the, uh, the network that's um, connecting them via Bluetooth and on your display right here. So if I go back to my home page, um, now I going to switch over to Stitcher Radio. Wait for that to connect. And as it connects, you can see on the f actual phone it shows you a little connection. Um, Pandora, I'm not sure if it does that or not. But um, what it does again is it'll just open up the first thing that's in your uh, group. Um, if you want to switch between categories, click on Menu my custom stations and there it has your playlist and then it has comedy the ones that you created so if I click on comedy the next thing it does is it'll just pull up uh, what's in your list I don't know how it pulls it up if it's just random or the first one in uh, alphabetical you know rotation or not um, but to change to a different one you can just move your scroll wheel just like you're choosing a, uh, you know, one of your stations from XM or FM or AM, um, and it'll find what you want here. Hit enter, and it'll start playing uh, the next one on your list. This one you can also star, like, favorite, or click to the next episode. Um, going back to the menu, we see upcoming shows, and basically that looks through any of your list to see what's uh, upcoming, um, and it'll display all those for you. Uh, my live radio I don't really use that feature um, but below that you have um, all the different categories that the stitcher radio provides so you can click into those and start searching for all their different types of uh, and it'll play like different things here it'll start playing it and if you switch it'll give you the different different type of, I chose horror, so it's giving me the different type of horror stations that Stitcher offers. Go back, back. So there's a little more options with the Stitcher than there is the um, Pandora, but uh, once you get them set up and start using them, you can get pretty uh, familiar with uh, how to get in there and do your, do your thing. So um, hopefully that video helped you out.